eight stores in three months. That's the number of times various subway locations in Lansing's metro area have been robbed, some at gunpoint. The most recent happened just before 930 this morning in Delta Township. Fox 47's Clayton Cummins talked with an employee who was inside the store during the robbery. I was frightened up, but I think we, me and my coworker handled it. Tense moments at this Saginaw Street subway Thursday morning in Delta Township. A man walks into a store with a hooded coat and mask on demanding money from the register. An employee inside spoke to Fox 47 News shortly after. We're not showing her face to protect her identity. He had a white sheet over his whole face, completely covered, couldn't see an eye, a nose, nothing. And he just told me to get over here to the register and I went to the register and we just gave him money and he walked away. The employee tells us the suspect got away with a little more than $100 and was calm. Subway robberies a trend as of late in Greater Lansing. Eight different robberies all in the course of three months. Today marks the second time the Saginaw and Waverly Street location has been robbed. Now this subway location behind me was one of many subway locations in the Metro Lansing area robbed since as far back as November of 2016. Now managers inside tell me they do not want to go on camera but did say that everyone is on edge. Three different police departments are investigating separate robberies at subway locations, including Lansing and East Lansing Police, along with the Eaton County Sheriff's Department. They're asking anyone with information to come forward. Give the person who's robbing you whatever they want. You know, don't, it's not worth losing your life over, or, you know. Clayton Cummins, Fox 47 News. Police aren't talking about the investigations and will not tell us if they believe the robberies are connected. We will continue to track this story and keep you updated with any new information.